He's the last one, and then he gets supersonic. Excellent! All systems, full power! Her mustache is still very blocky, though. Look at me! I'm your brilliant creator, Dr. Robotnik! You're the second of my E-100 model machines! E-102! Codename Gamma! Gamma. That's right! You will now obey only me. Now he moves nice and fast. The last two characters were not nearly this fast. He's about, I would say he's about tail speed. And he actually speeds up really fast though. He's got very good the acceleration. The range is through this door. Your big brother, E-101 Beta, is there practicing. Enter Gamma! You're not as advanced as Beta is, but you'll do fine. Destroy the Sonic Target. Destroy the targets, and you'll get extra time. Complete. Very, very easy. That one, there's nothing to, but uh, some of his states just get a little bit difficult. Because there's not really anything that can kill you in that stage. I'm not even sure you have to do this. But uh, I'll do it anyway, just in case. I don't think he can even get in there, that's why. He's too big. That's so much for trying. Oh, there we are. Good job, Gamma! I didn't think you had what it takes! Okay then, Gamma. Here's your test! If you want to stay on board, you must be able to pass it. So pay attention to what I say! This is actually the first time in Sonic's history where you actually play the villain. Technically, the Knuckles in Sonic 3 doesn't count, because you're not- he's not a, a villain, he's just tricked by Verponic. Come forth, Beta! I'd like you to meet your older brother, E101! And when you play as him, you're actually stopping the Mecha Robot. I don't and know exactly remember what he's called, ship. though. I put my bets on Beta, but I owe you at least a fair chance. Do 
too easy. Mission complete. Unlike Big, they actually put thought into this character too. So he actually comes out. The story actually comes out very interesting. Me, I had a funny feeling there was more to you than meets the eye. I hereby grant Gamma permission to serve on board the Egg Carrier. What? So you want to come along with us, eh? Okay, okay. We could always use a spare set of parts, I guess. You have special permission. Ah, oh, hello, Random. I don't know if one of the, uh, one of the robots might be a bit sick, though. I don't remember exactly. There's, uh, the only ones that I remember are Beta, the character you play Gamma. You know there's Epsilon, there's Delta. But I don't know if there's any others. Because I think at the end of all of the stages, you have to fight a, uh... Yeah, see, there's the other robots. I think it's, uh... Delta, Epsilon, and, uh... I don't remember what the last one is. Might be Sigma, or it could be Omega. You, the Elite Egg Carrier crew, are here today. To hear a very special announcement. Behold! It's a tailed frog! Very unique. There he is. This frog is absolutely <laughs> vital me. to my plans. I command you to locate this frog immediately! You hear me? I don't care what it takes to get it. Just bring it to me! We haven't got time to waste, so come to attention! AI fragments from Alpha. Up oh, there's cream. And cheese. Come back here. I like how they don't really care that I'm walking, a giant robot is walking around them. can't kill you. Damn it. Now, the lure was down here for... Yeah, since he can't touch water, he does this instead. Oh, yeah. I... It's sad to say, I haven't been keeping up with uh, Red vs. Blue. I th I've only watched up to... I don't even know what season. I actually go this way? No, I can't. Yeah, got that one already. So he knows I'm a robot, but he doesn't really care. <laughs> I know, I gotta go back and watch. I've actually been re-watching it. They have them all put together on Netflix. I uh, guess first stage is Emerald Coast. This way? Nah, I can't get. This is also something you can do. I think if you run long enough, he actually transforms into this, but you can also glitch it out when you're here, and he'll just. 
he'll just go into that form. I don't know, I'm even sure if that's a glitch, it might be intended. The important thing about E-102 is to always keep moving. Because your time runs out. Always keep moving. No, do not dawdle. Frog capture complete. But if you rush it like that, then it's really not that hard. In this case, it's very important. Because you, you saw that timer up there. I don't know if you've played this before. But rather than... Uh, rather than the timer going up like for everyone else, except for Big, he doesn't even have a timer. His starts at three minutes and counts down. You need to kill things to live. Which is unique. Must determine location. But if you're someone like me who has played this game on multiple occasions, it's really not that much of an issue. Accessing data. No data found. Location unknown. This presents a problem. <laughs> Mode change. Ah, uh, they spam the sound effect. As double V, as double V puts it, they look like blue pieces of crap. I think they look like teardrops, but I <laughs> can see where he gets that from. No idea what exactly she's talking the about. Guarding these children? He's a very loving and gentle creature. These little creatures are too vulnerable without its protection. This protection allows them to continue singing in peace. Even I was surprised the first time I saw him. Now my father is trying to take their sacred home. It seems his heart is closed off to us all. My true hope is that someday we'll understand each other. <clears throat> this frog's the one we want. No, here's the real one. My frog is the right one. Be of use to me. 
<laughs> All you worthless hunks of junk, be gone! I guess that's his way of saying thank you, sir. Without actually saying it. We'll be seeing them again you later. Get a new assignment. This one's easy. Go to the room through that last door. Once there, you'll find a girl and a bird. Just get me that bird. Now, go! Still a cutscene. Is this the one? <laughs> Love how he gets turned around like that. <laughs> this is why uh, this story is so interesting. Eggman wasn't kidding when he said he'd use uh, E101 for spare parts. Yeah, this was of the day and age where polygons were still sharp rather than smooth. Beta. This is the wrong room. And the higher the polygon count, well, this is kind of standard knowledge for most people. The more you, uh... The more polygons you have on something, the smoother you make it. So take uh, Agent 47's bald head, the uh, more polygons on his head, the smoother the uh, smoother his actual bald head actually looks. In older games, it might actually look spiky. Resistance is futile. Give me the bird. I said no! Why not? None of your business, why not? I want to know why you want it! Data unavailable. You don't even know? I bet you'd be mean to him, you bully! Her dress is still waking out. <laughs> Does not compute. Why try to save that which is useless to you? Does not compute. I feel sorry for you. Eggman failed to give you feelings. Wait a minute, Birdie! You actually find out in this story. Huh? I exactly bird makes him wicked big out like that. Why are you letting us go? Uh Amy, you might want to push your dress down. There you it go. Is dangerous here. Hurry, we'll be arriving at the Mystic Ruins base soon. You're not like those other robots, huh? You truly are a good person inside, aren't you? 
There's nothing in here that you can get. Oh! Now, I believe that's in one of the uh, side rooms up here. There it is. I saw E101 actually had this when we fought him. Here's the jet booster. Press and hold the jump button, and you'll float for a while. Actually, uh, Eggman and Tails in Sonic Adventure 2 have the same thing, since they're both an X in that one. Nothing else in here. A lot of people hated the fact that Tails is an X. I didn't mind it. Those levels weren't that bad. Report to the rear of the ship! Hurry! Actually, think you can get in the. Uh... Oh, you yeah, can. How can I serve you, Doctor Robotnik? All of those menaces. I like the way he said that. Eradicate all of these menaces. I will comply. I'm counting on you, Gamma. This uh, cutscene plays out a tad differently since we're the ones that won this time. Or E102 Sorry, is. Amy? Hey, Mr. Robot. I know you're not an evil sword. Wait, remember me? There's stuff going down my throat right now. <laughs> I am so sorry. Amy. Probably look like I'm about to throw up oh, or something. I really don't get this. I don't know why it's just suddenly happening. Sonic, look! The A carrier's losing altitude. We've got it split. Take Amy and go. What would you do? I'll nail that Eggman. He must be stopped at all costs! Thanks again for saving me as usual, Sonic! And how are you, my metal friend? It's dangerous here! Why not leave Eggman and come with us? Why do you help me? We'd be friends the next time we met. Even Bernie wants the best for you. You must ditch that awful egg man. Yeah, think of the bird. Come on. Uh, that was a really weird running animation. It's 
eyes actually bug out, I just noticed, whenever he goes into that mode. Dr. Robotnik, enemy, master registration, deleted, E-Series, friends, must save. And his idea of saving them is to totally annihilate them. You'll see why. It actually you makes sense if you think about it. Of wind. Gusts of strong winds are known to blow in the caves. I don't think there's anything in here for him either. Nope. Holy crap, I can actually get up here. Um, can't open that door though. I didn't think I could. Pick up. <laughs> I like that. He says pick up put down. And don't think there's anything here that he can get. Just wanna look in here first. I'm pretty sure he won't go into that mode when you're Can't hurt the monkey. Oh! Wicking out. Yeah, there's nothing in here for him. He does get one more power up. Mission failed. That was all me. It's actually one of three that go into this level. The robot you're looking for is up ahead. By the way, you also need enough time to fight them. You will lose your time if you don't. Or you will die if you run out of time. While you're fighting them. They're relatively easy to kill. E-103 Delta, rescue complete. Okay, once we get back to the overworld, I really have to go to the bathroom. I was hoping I could finish this before I have to, but I'm like fidgeting in my seat right now. Alright, 
I will be right back. I will not take that long. I swear. Still all this junk going down my throat. <clears throat> all right, I'm back. You have the beer to thank for that. I never saw the map to this. Truck. Oh. I don't really call that a truck. I'd call that a minecart. From what I remember, I go to Red Mountain next. He does not go to the Icy Caves. Or Ice Cap, but it's actually called. <clears throat> I swear there was something here for him. I don't think there is. There was something here for somebody. I don't think there is. As you can see, the Master Admiral all put together at this point.
God, I'm already on stage four. I think the hot shelter is his last stage. And the final boss is Omega. Er. Is it Omega? Alpha. Wow, I just avoided that. <laughs> Holy shit. Incredibly easy. All you have to do is keep shooting them. E104 Epsilon. Rescue complete. As long as you don't dawdle, they give you plenty of time to do those. E-104 Epsilon. Rescue mission accomplished. E-105 Zeta. E-101 Beta. Location unknown. Perhaps aboard the egg carrier. Zeta is in the hot shelter. E one hundred one is beta, not a uh, alpha. The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. Go to the egg carrier crash site. You might find something. He gets another power up too. I'm not sure if. Uh... I'm not exactly sure where it is. Hot shelter. D series location confirmed. Unlocking hot shelter sector now. be in here.
Oh no, I guess not. Your friends are in the hot shelter. Hurry up and rescue them. I already turned it. Hello, Bruce. How you doing? God! Jesus! I actually remember dying the last time something like this happened. Yeah, this is why this can be a little bit difficult. When you're in situations like this. Okay. 
That works. But he's not even remotely difficult. <laughs> so I had a hunt, one minute and twenty seconds to spare. E one oh five Zeta, rescue complete. Plenty of time. I should be able to finish this tonight. Zeta rescue complete. Units remaining. Ah, there's the twist. Gamma. And there is Beta. Beta. He does that charge. God damn it. Are you serious? One more and he's dead. He's dead. He got nothing on me. Mission complete. And that's the end of E102. Two ways this time. But the end of his story and the end of him. Let's we'll see why I say that in a second.
Or see, pretty much already revealed it. We were saving the other robots by killing them. But it's not the robots themselves that you were saving. It's those birds. I do actually feel bad for him because he knows he has to die. Because that bird's inside of him. It's also why his character was never used in another Sonic game. Omega's kind of like him in Sonic Heroes. A little more evil. He kind of has to be because he's been paired up with Shadow and Rouge. The pink one's in him. For the sake of gameplay, you can still go back and play him. Because you can go back and do objectives in different stages. I didn't do that personally, because I'm just getting through the story on stream. But yeah, this is actually one of the better stories for this game. It's actually a little heartfelt. And I just got the achievement, Super Sonic. You unlock him by beating the game with every character. Now the Super Sonic story is literally just story and a boss. Wait for the credits again. But yeah, I remember having actually a monumental amount of trouble with E102 because of the fact that I was getting hit constantly. And I was dawdling a lot. Because with uh, E102, unlike with the other characters, as you witnessed, your time counts down rather than counting up. So you really only have three minutes plus to beat the stage. And I think I actually remember failing once on a hot shelter when I was at the boss and I ran out of time. I was in the Dreamcast version, too. Had a little bit of an easier time with it when I, I had played the GameCube version. I got a, about an hour and a half yet of time that I can. Uh, but I do think. Um, I don't think I have enough time to stream anything else after this. <laughs> I gotta get a shower tonight for work anyway, so. Uh, once I beat Super Sonic, that'll be it for the night. Uh, I will start on Assassin's Creed Revelations tomorrow. And then I'll do Throwback Thursday provided... Provided I don't get uh, something work-related happening. That's always... I always have that issue. Oh, well, it's always something in the back of my mind. But, uh... 
So unless, uh, let's just say this, unless real world stuff ever happens, expect me to stream Monday through Thursday at this around this time, always. First description, everything you need to know is all below, just like every other streamer you probably see. All the information that you need to know is right below. I used to play World of Warcraft on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I don't anymore. I canceled my subscription. The actual subscription ends on the 26th, but I stopped playing WoW on stream entirely as I got done with it. So I'm no longer a WoW streamer. I'm a variety streamer. But Thursdays, I do plan to do something special just to change things up every week. So I'm not just doing the same thing in and out. Um, Thursdays, I do throwback Thursdays. And you know how, like, on social media, like Facebook or Twitter, people, like, post pictures of the younger selves? Or they post something that makes people nostalgic? I'm taking that and rolling with it. Uh, on Thursdays, I play something that I really enjoyed from my youth. And I just replay it on stream. And it might be multiple Thursdays that I play the same game. It, it depends on how long it is. I plan on doing Ocarina of Time first, so that definitely will be in more than one stream. 